Hello there uh, friends of YouTube, uh, today I just want to show you this ZVS driver I've just built onto this aluminium heatsink. If you remember from my previous videos, it, um, there was two of these together in um, series uh, on a power supply. That's what I found at the tip and I looked at it and thought, hmm, that'll make a good little heatsink for a ZVS driver. So here it is, all built up. The uh, transistors are IRFP to 60s and the xenodiodes are 15 volts and there are 10k green resistors there on the top and these are 1k and these are blocked. Oh god, I always get that tone every time I'm doing a video. And these are uh, fast switching diodes there. I'll give you the number on them, it's number on them, it's MUR1540 and my capacitor which I've just not long chucked on because I've not properly tested this yet so the, the one I'm just to put on in for now is a 3.3 UF uh, 10 to 400 volt so that, uh, let's try making sure that this is properly connected up in there so and the flyback there is off a 26 inch bloody phone so I'll connect it up on a 12 volt battery, the one I found at the tip, which is a brand new one, which works perfectly fine. <coughs> I'll connect it up. Let's see what arcs we've got. You can really feel the heat off these arcs, can't you? So there you go. And earlier on, I got a bleeding shock off that. I put my hand straight, straight on it. And this wire, well, I, I did actually put the wire just there like that. And it had just slipped down. Just, just the right moment of me picking that bloody fly back up. So now when I've finished, I have to make sure that I do that. So, as it did it, I just grabbed hold of it like that and burnt me there. And burnt me there, look. Now, trust me guys, it really hurts. Um, it made my arm, my arm shake and it was shaking for a bit afterwards. But it's not the first shock I've had from a flyback. It's probably the third shock I've had off a flyback. And I shall probably get more in the future. But dealing with a high voltage, you are going to get bitten now and again. So there's always something that takes your mind off something. If you're doing something else and you're thinking of something else and you don't realise and you just touch it. So I'm just going to warn you guys, if you're new into this, you're going to get bitten. <laughs> we always do. 240 volt shocks, I don't give a shit about them, I've had loads of those, I've lost count how many times I've had 240 volt shocks from the, the uh, mains wall outlet, um, but shocks off these things, I b would say, hurt a lot more, but anyway, um, I hope you've enjoyed the video guys, uh, look after yourselves, be safe please, um, take care of yourselves, and uh, we'll speak again, bye.